Hey, what's up, Collective? Welcome back to the channel, Super Core Brothers. My name is Conan, and today we're playing Cyberpunk 2077 on very hard mode. Make sure you strike that code of arms to become a subscriber, and hit the little bell so you don't miss any of the action. Let's get it. What the hell are you guys doing? Freaking weirdos. Why? Why? Hmm. Watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. Any V, yo, listen up. <laughs> I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. It's funny. He's waiting in his Heart ride chakra. for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my best to talk this out. V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's, that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. All right, Regina, whatever. I'm not sure that that's going to work for me. Sweet floating car, man. How you get that car to float like that? Is that your car? Como estas? I'm good. How are you? Check that car out. I need a floating car. Dude, I think there's one more. There he is. Don't run for me. Right on, I got 200 bucks for taking those dudes out. <laughs> Alright, gotta go meet with Dex. Let's go see what's up with that nerd. Except for now, I'm pretty sure that every Tiger Claw in the city knows that I just took out some of their cohorts. And they're gonna wanna kill me. What's up, man? Somebody's shooting at me already, see? 
Let's go. Yo, Miss V. A pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> uh, I just called you fat. Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Sure, what's you up? You rather live in peace as Miss Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your thirtieth? Mm, sure. This some sort of test? Eh, just a pet topic of mine. I mean, riddles? No, Miss V. Ontology. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. All right, what's it? What's up? Hang on, got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Bug sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Daxter in the past. And sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Well, hurry up. Tell me. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Simple. Mm. Guessing it belongs to a corp? Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Nope. Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. All right, you sounds this good. Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Klein who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. All right, let me see it. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see? Convoy was carrying the flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single use toy. What? Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when. Because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, aka Royce, plain dropped his ass. What? Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shipstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Okay. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Nice. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. All right. Who's client. the client? What's her thing? Why does she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Well, I guess that's Yours me. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. 
Oh, thanks. I think right. I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Well. All right, One more then. thing to speak. What was that? Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Um, blaze of glory, bro. Let's go. Later now. All right, then. You're just gonna drop me off in the ghetto decks? What's up, Jackie? Talk to Dex. Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot military prototype. Maelstrom clipped it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had to switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. Yep. About sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deeds of some Militech agent too, but don't know how much help she stands to be. Zero. <laughs> yeah, he don't sound thrilled. Royce, what do you know about him? He's fucking whack something special. Junkie snort junk. Royce snorts chrome. What? Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table, Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Mm hmm I don't know, man. I'm thinking, leave me alone. Hmm. Let's start with the Parker lady. Parker. Think I ought to see her. See what she's like, what she's after. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Stick around. Hasta luego. Hasta luego, buddy boy. Alright Collective, don't forget to strike that code of arms to become a subscriber. Hit the little thumbs up button to let me know you like what we're doing. Leave me a comment down below to tell me how much you like Cyberpunk 2077. And hit the little bell so you never miss any content. And peace.